friends. No, it's not. Then we'll put on <laughs> the painting on. <laughs> the grease paint is on. The actors are kitted. The instruments are tuned. Yeah. No, they're not. The scenery is <laughs> fitted. <laughs> Where's Gwyn? <laughs> now, this is a tale of Freudian perversion. Oh. So, with you, we're obliged to uh, play the cleaned up version. Now, I'll now, I'll now say the title. It's nothing rude. It's the tale of Little Miss Riding Hood. <laughs> she lives by the forest that's deep, dark, and scary. Been like being a home. In a it? cottage <laughs> with Mark. <laughs> Whose face is quite hairy. <laughs> In a cottage with Ma. Whose face is. <laughs> Steve, I think you scored. <laughs> Where is Bailey? Where is he? Steve? Here, Chief. Hold on. <laughs> she's tough on her daughter just as soon as Hoodie wakes she's given all her chores while Ma just bakes cakes <laughs> Hoodie, your grandmother is ill and stuck in her bed you must take her some food it is this wholemeal bread <laughs> oh, hello cakes <laughs> Hotel. <laughs> <laughs> the deep forest noises, a moan. <laughs> Hoot. <laughs> and howl. <laughs> <laughs> began to concern her. The noises were so foul. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bell. Where are you headed? I'm 
off to my grandma who's stuck in her bedding. <laughs> and doubting the way, I was following the tracks over the downs, but all I could see were the roots to the town. Can you, Mr. Morris, a finger post be, and point me thy way to my granny? Regard, my dear Goody, <laughs> as music starts playing, the route that you need I'll soon start displaying. <laughs> <laughs> Watch my bronze cars, the route they are showing. The wolf will come near as I dance and I flower. Follow my signs. You'll be there in an hour. Oh, technical failing. This never went wrong in the rehearsal. <laughs> yeah, which oh, one? yes, it did. Oh, yes, it did. <laughs> oh, yes, it did. <laughs> oh, yes, it did. <laughs> uh, not <decided> yet. <laughs> folding bike. <laughs> no, not surprising. He hasn't made it up yet. No. Oh. I say, I say, I say, how do you get two whales in a mini? Yeah. With great so deal of me. Ah. Over the end. You can't get two whales. about whales, we'll have to ask Winnie. <laughs> <laughs> Winnie. <laughs> we are lost. <laughs> We're doomed. <laughs> We're in deepest Surrey, darkest Surrey. I know I'm beginning to worry. We've lost all the ladies. Tess, Jen, Maggie and Maggie Parker. 
Thank goodness we still have our trusty back marker. Don't worry, bikers. I always will find you. You're quite safe with me as I push up behind you. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't like this. <laughs> 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 you quite like it. <laughs> Gosh, it's tough in this role. It could hardly be worse. But let me explain by means of this verse. <coughs> so back by popular demand, oh, no. as a tradition, is oh, the yeah, back mark of poets. Five years and going. As all the lovely vales and hills, you happy bikers troop, don't forget that lonely guy, the back marker of the group. They help their colleagues over styles and stay to close the gates, they're often left quite far behind, for no one ever waits. Aww. The party goes quite far ahead, then stops to rest and scoff. But immediately they catches up, the whole look pushes off. <laughs> <laughs> and when at last they pass it on, they know they've knelt to fear, they've earned their place in paradise, just bringing up the rear. <laughs> Back to the proper plot. <laughs> My banana's unzipped. I know. Is Ed not back yet? To collect up our skins in her polythene sack. And that's the clean version. <laughs> so I take out my orange. I really don't know where to take the pit. It's not really taken really? by Mike Felton Smith! <laughs> 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 oh, hello! What do I see? Wandering down yonder hill, a maiden in red with a basket to fill. I'm tired, and I'm lost, and I'm late. Okay. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to reach my grandma's abode. It's behind Elstead Mill. Oh, pray tell me the road. John Park can soon tell by the press of a button. <laughs> <laughs> Straight away on my screen, here's a direction to Sutton. What's this? Use is that. It needs to concentrate. We must stop talking. Hmm, it's telling me now that we're one mile from Dorking. <laughs> <laughs> but where is Elstead Mill? Oh, don't be so silly. Shifty, don't be so shifty. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell you that, love, because we ride with Go 50. <laughs> <laughs> just, just follow us, dear, as we cycle our rounds, but at journey's end, we'll ask you for two pounds. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have no money. I'm poor and forlorn. Oh. You idiots. <laughs> I'll walk on my own. <laughs> Jay Jay is our leader. He's so sparse and he's so strong. But he's left us behind and I've broken my prong. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have in your basket, you loveliest wench, a tool that is called a hexagonal wrench? Funny you should ask, a, biter, a biker who needed a shave, called Alan. called Alan, a biker called Alan, who needed a shave, gave me a key and said, Hand it to Dave. <laughs> That's me, I'm David, so since you brought it along, you can give it to me and I can fix up my prong. <laughs> <laughs> but I must say, young damsel, oh, I must say, young damsel, <laughs> your buns do look tasty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sir, your grab is too hasty. <laughs> Please, little girl, can't I take just one? Oh, I'm squidgy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> Unscripted. I'm going to take just one cake. <laughs> <laughs> but they're not quite as fruity as Kev's missus makes. Oh. Oh. Okay. I'll try this green one topped with a berry. Mm. I'll have to save this for later and give it to old Jerry. Another <laughs> <laughs> pursue our gammy head gammy head our gammy need leader. <laughs> When she's out on her bike, you don't half have to feed her. <laughs> There's only one left, and it's my turn to pick. I tell, oh, I'll tell you what, I'll have that and save it for Nick. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you, young girlie, for your tasty grub. We'll have to ride off now. Can't be late for the pub. <laughs> She might make her some tea by boiling the pan. Oh. <laughs> and at least that bad boy oh. oh. <laughs> kept his paws off her. Her ma was concerned that Wolfie might scoff her. And Granny's cottage lies beyond. I'll take a rest. I'll get a drink. I'll spit some water on this pond. Oh, who are you there, sir, a lurking? I'm sorry, you're smart. <laughs> Your banjo ready in hand. <laughs> Why aren't you in the mill working or playing in the village band? I'm sorry, you're a star boy. I meant you no wrong, but I'll explain it all to you that I'm so big a song. You can all sing along. <laughs>
gone too slow Guess we'll never know Did his ease tire go down again? Did someone lose another chain? We'll see With his foot clicked in
I mustn't think that I'm well, I'm not sickly. <laughs> I'm less pulling my eyes. I'm not even bad. Nobody will bring me cakes and fresh bread. Oh. Oh. This is how we live, all people in prison. <laughs>
<laughs> Poor Red Riding Hood. She sure got molested. She's now in Wolf's stomach. Yummy, yummy. Being digested. <laughs> <laughs> happened to her? Ma is sure to fret. But wait, her basket is over there clearly. I'll call out her name so she's sure to hear me. <laughs> hoodie! Hoodie! Hmm. It is very strange that Grandma snores and her hands does look like paws. <laughs> <laughs> and her nose has formed a snout. And her belly's got so stout. It's very strange. She sleeps and snores and smiles. Boys and girls, do you know where Red Riding Hood is? Yes! Ah. I should have guessed. Tis Wolfie who's in that bed dressed as a floozy. Johnny <laughs> gobbled Hoodie up and that's why he's so snoozy. <laughs> I get out my chopper, and yeah. before he can speak to me, I must perform a hoodie et to me. <laughs> <laughs> now this is tricky, Wolfie, because you're such an Aryan, I'll have to do it by quick cesarean. <laughs> <laughs> My friend commends you with three stitches. There's not more of that. Left you. you didn't think I'd walk this far. Lumberjack walked me. Now, in his car. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry to interrupt. We're searching for the red girl's basket. We're in I placed our precious casket. To save him weight while on the bike. I hope that's it. All bike baskets look alike. It's the right one, and here's the casket. Hooray! 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 Thank you, young girl, for conveying our basket, your basket. This casket contains our precious hoards of this year's Go 50 Cycling Awards.
Riding Hood lived happily ever after. Oh. Yeah.